Hello, today I am talking about vertical gardening and string training. I am going to be using this, these cucumber plants to show you how that's done. Uh, first of all, we're going to plant the cucumber plant. Cucumbers, like many vine plants, um, do not like their roots being touched. So I've dug a hole the size of the pot and then I'm going to fill in around it with soil, packing it down nicely around the actual pot. Then I'm going to carefully pull the pot out and as you can see there's a perfect imprint of the pot in here. So now I can just loosen the plants out of the pot and pull them out. They'll slide right into the hole like that put some extra soil around to finish it off and that is finished. No more touching or fussing with it and these cucumbers should be fine. So when I'm done with this video I'll just water it and add some organic fertilizer. Now on to vertical gardening. The reason why I'm using vertical gardening is because it saves on horizontal space. If I were to leave these cucumbers go they would very quickly spill up, fill up this whole space. Um, it's a 9 by 12 garden and if I were to plant this in the middle it would probably fill up the whole entire space but you only need this amount for your actual root. This is about an 18 inch pot. So vertical gardening allows you to be far more efficient with the use of your space. Another advantage to vertical gardening is it's all going to be up so I will be able to see the fruit easily. As you can see, I've got cucumbers coming on already, so it's very easily to pick, it's easy to see, as well as the vines not laying on the ground means that they are not going to be as susceptible to molding and rotting of the fruit. So what I have is some twine that are screwed into the ceiling rafters of the greenhouse, and I'm just going to remove my little support post here and oh and there's tendrils that have tied themselves onto it already I've got three little plants here in one so what I'm going to do is take and tie the twine around the base of the plant not very tightly because you're going to have to loosen this as the plant grows the stem will widen as well so I'm going to just tie the twines around a couple of the plants here tricky with these gloves on and that's the way that's done oh come on now there we go okay next you simply take your plants and very gently wrap them around the string or the twine just like that and as you can see it stays up like that as the plant gets larger you'll just continue twining and it will climb up to the ceiling and you'll also want to be uh, doing a bit of pruning as it goes. You only want this sort of general central sprout going on. So if it starts to branch off, you want to prune those branches off. So anyway, thank you for watching and I hope you've learned something today. Please like my video if you'd like to see more of them. Thank you.